question 18. A, B, C, D and A, E, F, G are mathematically similar trapeziums. Let's just highlight that word similar because it's going to be very important to this question. We're told A, E is 5 centimetres, E, F is 12 and B, C is 18. We're asked to work out the length of A, B. So we want this distance here. Now, because the shapes are mathematically similar, what we're going to want to work out is um, the length scale factor or the linear scale factor. And the way we do that is we take corresponding sides and we're going to divide them. So this side here, the 18, and this side here, the 12, are what I would call corresponding sides. So the LSF, or the length scale factor, is going to be found by doing, I always do the big side divided by the small. So I'm going to do 18 divided by 12. 18 over 12 is going to be the same as 3 over 2, which is 1.5. Okay, so to go from the small side to the big, I would times by 1.5. Now, if I want, if I know that this side here, AE, is 5 centimeters, to get the large length, AB, I need to do 5 times 1.5. And 5 times 1.5. It's going to be 7.5. And that's part A in the bag. Next part, it says the trapezium AEFG has an area of 36 centimeters squared. So AEFG, so that's our small trapezium. This guy here has an area of 36 cm squared. We're asked to work out the area of the shaded region. Now, if I was normally doing this, what I would do is I'd like to know the area of the big trapezium, and then I would subtract the area of the small trapezium, and that's going to give me the shaded region. So let's go for working out the area of the big trapezium. Now, we know that the length scale factor is 1.5. We're going to need to work out something called the area scale factor, and the area scale factor is found by doing the length scale factor squared. So we need to do 1.5 squared, and 1.5 squared, well, 15 squared is 225. So 1.5 squared is going to be 2.25. So if I know that the area of this is 36, the area of the big trapezium is going to be 36 multiplied by 2.25. So we, we should be able to work this out in our heads. Uh, if I double 36, so 36 times 2 is going to be 72. And 36 times 0 0.25, 0 0.25 is a quarter. So what is a quarter of 36? Hopefully you're screaming at the screen saying it's 9. So we've got 72 plus 9 is going to give me 81 centimeter squared 81 centimeter squared so that means the shaded region is going to be found by doing uh, 81 centimeter squared 81 centimeter squared minus the 36 so subtracting um, 36 uh, 30 from 80 is 50 uh, so the answer is going to be 40 Five. Let's just double check that one. Six and five is eleven. Three and four is seven. Carry the one is eighty-one. So we're good there. Forty-five centimeters squared, and that should be good enough for all three marks.